best way to get through the coldest season in Iowa. Channel 13 photojournalist Roger Riley went up north to show us what it's all about. High above Okoboji, it's easy to see that people here seem to be fond of winter. The Okoboji Winter Games features broomball for the adults and youth hockey. This snow softball team got beat out, but are still enjoying being outside. You know, everybody gets cabin fever when it's really cold out. You gotta have a little bit of break from just being at home, cooped up, get out here and, you know, enjoy things with the friends. For this art project, a group of volunteers posed on frozen West Lake Okoboji to form a turtle. The turtle is the logo of a local arts group. Even though it's January, these people seem to be fond of winter. Chad Elliott put the pattern in the ice, I mean in the snow, on the ice ahead of time. And then there were 172 people that uh, went over and lined up and he just had us walk out in certain places. And uh, they were just ready when the plane came over and then uh, you guys helicopter came over. Oh, no. oh what a save! Tom Van Tassel participated in the art project and came over to play a pickup game of hockey. Go night! That's just fun. For me, it's like being a kid again. I want these guys to have the same experience. The search and rescue team demonstrated how they work to rescue people in the water, even when some don't want to be rescued. 125 people, hardy and without winter clothing, decided to take the plunge. What's more amazing is they each paid $10 for the privilege. The money goes to help fund the search and rescue squad. Some are fond of winter with motorized toys. Power. Uh, a lot of power. The Clark family of Milford makes a weekend of it. I'm marinated pork loin going here. As the fire of the sun sinks into the ice of Westlake Okoboji, pickup and snowmobiles head across the bay for a big event to close the day. Torches light the fire of discarded Christmas trees and the people can get warm. Snowmobiles move like fireflies across the frozen lake to get in place for the finale. Fireworks shooting into the sky. It's obvious people here seem to be fond of winter, especially when the thick ice turns a body of water into a huge playground. With pilot Fred Redman, Roger Riley, Channel 13 News. Roger Riley. I love his story. Oh, they're always, always so interesting. Yeah.